Hi there, I'm Monice Lagam with your Fox News Now update. We now know the name of the victim in that deadly shooting at a Tillman's Corner Hotel. They say Melissa Cody was inside a room yesterday when a man shot her in the stomach. According to investigators, another man with Melissa returned fire, hitting the first shooter in the leg. Police say that person drove himself to an urgent care about a mile away. And at last check, both men were being interviewed by police. Another shooting investigation in Tillman's Corner. Shots fired on Calhoun near Nevius and government this morning. Police say a woman was taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. No word what led to that shooting or whether police have any potential suspects. Well, a member of the Alabama football coaching staff waking up behind bars. Defensive coordinator Pete Golding arrested at around 1 o'clock this morning for DUI in Northport. His bond was set at $500. The University of Alabama has yet to comment on that arrest. All right, let's track our forecast. We got active weather across the region in our area as of early evening. Still a severe threat that will diminish overnight and winter storm to the north and west. That's not coming our way, but we all getting into the colder air showing up in the forecast. No doubt about it. As we look at our future cast real active for the evening, but things get more scattered by nine o'clock. We'll be tracking at 9 p.m. on Fox 10 News overnight seeing showers and storms continuing this line. Real slow to move, so we're going to linger on Friday with much colder air in here. We'll have temperatures tomorrow. Look at the struggle tonight. The front comes through around midnight. After that, a steady drop. We get into the 40s for our daytime highs tomorrow, and really the daytime high technically will be after midnight, but our temperatures through the day plummet and colder air with us down to 34 Friday night with some wind Saturday for Senior Bowl Saturday. Low 50s, a breeze and some sunshine freezing Saturday night and more nights in the 30s ahead in your extended outlook.